All right, hello everyone. My name is Haini Vassander. I'm the marketing director at Super Evil Megacorp. We make core games on touchscreens in San Mateo, California. Ha. All right, I'm Finnish. I've had the amazing opportunity to grow up with the startup and game scene here in Finland, the cold far north. Um, I was part of Alta Entrepreneurship Society since, since 2009, and I was actually one of the organizers of this very conference, so it feels kind of amazing to be on stage here today. Thank you so much for the opportunity. Um, it's super inspirational to see how Slush has become this crazy tech event with people around the world. Um, so it's so awesome that you're all here. Okay, so not only have I worked in the startup scene, I've also worked in games. Some of you may know me from my previous gig at Supercell. Um, awesome company, I, I did communications over there and I'm so thankful for that experience. Um, today, I'm lucky to be part of something maybe even more groundbreaking. Super Evil Megacorp. We're today launching our first game, Vanglory, which is a MOBA perfected for touch. The team, um, which has people from companies like Riot, Blizzard, Insomniac Games, Playfish, they've been working two and a half years on Vanglory, and we're so happy to, to launch it today globally. Um, who's familiar with the term MOBA? Can I see a raise of hands? Okay, a lot of people, awesome. Well, for those of you who do not know, it's short for Multiplayer Online Battle Arena. It's the most popular gaming genre on the PC. It's played by over 90 million people every month. Um, yeah, and, and so what we're trying to do, or what we're today doing actually, is, is launching a MOBA on touchscreens. Um, our game has pretty amazing graphics and we were featured in an Apple's keynote back in September. And from the beginning, our aim has really to build a true core game experience. We're not trying to casualize a game for the sake of bringing it to this new platform, nor are we trying to make a direct port of an existing game. So what the team really did, they kind of broke, broke down the anatomy of the MOBA, looked at how that game genre could work better on touchscreens, and really started from there. So it's been you know, a process of reimagining everything from heroes to map design, game design. Um, so it's been a lot of hard work and, and we're really happy to get it out. Um, for example, in a core game, one of the key things is the controls. You want to be able to focus on playing, not on how to play. And so then Glory is played by tapping um, instead of like a lot of different kind of stuff. So it actually makes it very easy. And certain key movements um, in MOBAs, such as kiting, where you're kind of running to one direction and shooting to another, it's very easy to do, because you're just using your two index fingers instead of like a mouse and keyboard type of situation. So, Vinglory, it's a battle between two teams. You're playing in a team of three people against another three people, real time. Um, you control a hero, and the goal of your team is to shatter the vein crystal which is on in the enemy team's base. It's a little bit like capture the flag, except that you're trying to stay alive too. Um, and so the enemy's vein is defended by powerful turrets in the lane. So there's three in the lane on your side, three on the enemy side, and then there's two more turrets next to the vein crystal. Um, it's a lot of teamwork, a lot of um, coordination, and, and it gets pretty intense pretty quickly. Um, and what you need to do is earn gold pretty quickly so that you can start building your hero up in the game. So you apply, buy some items for it, make it stronger, etc. So those of you who have known MOBAs, you, you kind of know the drill. Um, and so yeah, um, our game is a lot of fun to play alone, but it's also one of the like, best things about the tablet is that it's portable. So you can easily play LAN party style with friends in the same room. Um, and that's what our video is about. I'd like to show you this one.
All right. I wonder if my next slide will show up. Maybe? Oh, there we go. <laughs> All right. Um, and the reason why Vainglory matters and why I'm really ex excited about this is that it's really not only just about our game or our company. This is about being right at the center of the next really big thing and the revolution in games. Touchscreens are finally poised to take their place as the primary gaming devices alongside the console and PC in the core gamers' hands. That's the most exciting thing that's going on in games right now. If you look at gaming overall, um, core games still account for about 72% for the industry's revenue. This number is from 2013. However, if you do look at the App Store selection, there's really not that much core gaming content there. So we really do believe that this will change. There will be more core games on, on the App Store, and core gamers will find these games and devices. Whether it's us that does it or whether it's someone else, we'll see. Um, but this is definitely the most interesting thing in games right now. Um, I'm super, super, super excited to announce that we're today launching Vainglory in the App Store. You can download it on the iPad 2 and up, and also on the iPhone uh, models with metal, so that means iPhone 6, 6 Plus, and 5S. So that is pretty much it. Thank you so much for having me here. Um, here's my contact information. Please feel free to email me or add me in the game. Um, Evil Finn over there, I'm happy to play a match or two with you anytime. Um, I'm hosting the Silver Stage, but other than that, if you see me around, I always lo love talking about games. Thank you so much.